So we made it here to Willow Bank Raceway, and there is rumor that some of the cars some didn't make it okay. Messed up in the cars. We so. have not seen ours yet. Are we good? Of course, we strapped that down ourselves. <laughs> I don't even know what you was worried about. <laughs> and the golf cart looks like it's definitely this way a little bit, but hey, if that's the worst that happens. Yeah. Oh yeah, the golf cart is on the wing. Oh man. Yeah, golf cart's on the wing, but that's really it. It's not bad. Nah. Not I mean, bad. golf cart's de definitely on the wing. Yeah. Yeah. Okay back there? Yeah. Golf cart's on the wing, but other than that, like that, that ain't a big deal. Yeah. Uh, remember when I said that if the golf cart hit the car and the if parachutes would hit it, that was not a true statement. I had lied to you earlier. Well, that's what so, I was looking at you very I was really worried about this. This mind. is what I was worried about. But of course, we, we put everything up really, really good. Uh, <laughs> and, and you know, this just, you know, this, it's good. But look at this, though. Uh, I didn't go nowhere. This is the one I strapped. It's good. Yeah. This one's a little fucked up, but that's okay. Um, the car is not up against the side because, of course, we put the. Did you not put. No, the wheel next time. Oh, uh, you didn't. Yeah, you fucked up, huh? Yeah. You never. First time strapping a car. I, I usually got one was a little nice there, back. He's usually got people to do it for him. What? He usually got people that do it for him. Is this four lane Ooh. No, <laughs> that, is, that is what we're going to try to put our tip down with. <laughs> These right here work really good. For the tents? Maybe they're down all that shank. Dave showed me that like five years ago, man. Regular whisker goes right in that spot. Yeah. So I do mine, man. All right, well. Oh, you got golf cart on the wing? Uh, that's what it looks like so far. I, I could give two shits about the stuff in the back. Yeah, you that's, you know, go. we ain't got no toolbox anyways. So. You don't need no toolbox. What up? <laughs> What's happening? I was trying to, uh, it's got bumps here, so I was going to take the stock tie rod in, drill it out, and just put it on the top, because it's almost that far out. Oh, yeah. But it's just too much. No shit? Yeah, that ain't going to work either. She needs to buy it. Oh, it needs to go up. She needs to buy that front end first thing, man. Yeah. Or get rid of it and use her no prep keys car as a small tire car. One or two. <laughs> What's your car hit? No, no, no. How'd you let all these people in, Kai? I know, man. Like, we need time to get set up. Oh, man, that's not that. Yeah, it'll make you sick, man. I get Hey, I get it. Especially if this was my MPK car, I'd be, I'd be upset, too. But not that car. <laughs> That car's just beat the shit. What sucks about that? Yeah, look, and it got it back here and right here. They tow Nell and Ryan's car in here? Yeah. Because he can beat. I'll get them unloading it. Everyone was mad at me that I guess I didn't show ours being unloaded on the last video. I thought I did, but I guess not. What, like? Coming off. Coming off the truck? Yeah, I thought I did. Without trucks, Australia stops. Exactly right, brother. I overnighted this from Sydney. I've not slept in two days. Yeah. Welcome to our world. It'll come off this side. Yeah, but you want to push it over so that the front on the right line. So you can touch We don't care about the white line. Yelling at each other and shit. Oh yeah, oh yeah. <laughs> and then we get done and we be, ah. Yep, it looks great. Yep, it's great.
first full day here at Willow Bank. And again, Aussies have shown out. There's just people everywhere. How's it going, man? So, car's ready. We just warmed it up. Sean's over there signing babies and kissing hands and what have you. Got the farm truck out. They just had it over there warming it up. It's still the line. And this is just the VIPs. They have not opened the gates to uh, general admission just yet. So we suspect it's going to get pretty wild in here. It's pretty cool cars here. Everyone wants to race Sean. Uh, big tires, small tires, wheelie bars, all that stuff. So, what's up, guys? <laughs> so, uh, I think we got like an hour or two before we figure out how the race is actually going to go down this week. Um, so, we don't know who we're racing yet or how many times we're racing or anything like that. But we will find out pretty soon. So, get back down here, wade through this line again, and. Uh, figure out what we're doing here shortly and then we'll let y'all know so stick around so so we didn't think we were going to get a test pass turns out we get us a test pass right uh, i believe that because of ryan and robin's situation uh i i think that we're all getting one including the australians so uh, i'm cool with it yeah. uh, i didn't really care either way I, i'd have been fine with it but i did think that ryan and and Robin should have both got test passes. Oh, for sure, for sure. So. Both, I mean, Ryan's car hit the wall, you know what I mean? And then Robin's rolled around in a trailer. So they absolutely, yeah. for, for if not like if nothing else, for safety, you know what I mean? For to make sure. sure those cars are gonna Robin go Robin was even like, man, just let me go to the 60 foot. Yeah. I don't care, just let me make sure it gets out of the hole straight, yes. you know? And I, I believe that they should have, you know? But everybody's talking about it. it's pretty slick up there. I guess we're gonna find out. So, somebody just went down. Yeah. Sounded like. So, we'll find out. You know. I mean, I'm sure it is slick if uh, your car isn't set up for it. So. Little Monte Carlo there with the. Oh yeah, I seen that down there. <laughs> I figured I'd hear. Why didn't you bring your dog? You know. Oh yeah. So. Oh, he's towing that other car. That's cool. Uh, yes. Of course. How to feel? How do I yell that? Ah, uh, fucking good. Dude, it looked amazing. Hey, dude. It, it was fucking hey, stuck the whole way. I hope the draggy lick. worked. Hey, it made a fucking lick, dude. Frank was pretty excited.
finna get yelled at. <laughs> oh, I do like bolts out. I'm finna, so fast I'm finna get yelled at, dog. <laughs> Did you not buckle it down? I'm guessing the, the screws weren't in it. <laughs> okay, I messed up. We have these nice little bolts here in front of the hood. Set of Zeus's. I didn't put them in. So, about 160, 165. Caught enough air, ripped it off. So now, got some nice tape folded on there. You know what I mean? I'm sure it'll be fine. You like the new custom hood or no? Ah, oh, dude, it's fucking great. Yeah. Yeah, it looks good. You can't even hardly tell. No, it's flat black. Bunny hopped it to the 60 foot. So, so if you remember all the times we talked about how crazy the Australians are, wow. and then we got here and we we're kind of like, ah, hey, you know, a yeah. bunch of rules and shit here. We found him. It, there That's he the is. fucking guy right man. there, man. God damn it. All right, so it is Saturday, I think, uh, month three here in Australia. Um, and this still's taking forever, to be totally honest with you. It's about four o'clock I think in the evening 4 30 and uh, we're just coming up for our first pass of the day so we don't really know who we got um, but Sean has given him the back tire I love you cunt I yeah. love you cunt <laughs> so, you're a good cunt we, we really don't know who we got all we know is that you gave him the back tire yeah I don't know how dumb is that yeah we just knew that we had to give people some stuff hey come here yes you know the one car that we were all too lazy to go walk? That's the dude I got. Hey, so we didn't even look at his car. <laughs> <laughs> I, don't, I don't know what that. I have no oh, idea. Goodness. I don't know anything about it. He's got the back tire, though. Yeah, yeah. that guy's got the back tire. Yeah, my dumbass gave my guy the head. Hey, and he's got what we heard was the fastest car here. Yeah, nice. That's a bold, yeah, bold right. move. You know, we watched him a couple of times, and we're banking on he ain't going to make it down. Right. Damn it. That way, hand is a single shooter. <laughs> oh, oh, single, single ride. So, how you feel? We made it. We made some pretty good licks last night. You we know, did, but it's greasy as shit. It, it is. Right it is cooling off though. Like the sun isn't directly on the track now, but it's not like it's getting a whole bunch better up there just yet. Yeah, but look, man. Without me saying we're kicking the shit out of them, we're kicking the shit out of them. So, it, it, at some point, when do you get the guy who goes, ah, fuck it, and throws that Hail Mary tune up in there and sends it? Yep. You know what I mean? These guys know how to race. They just, uh, they're not good with, uh, radio, you know, they're good with radials. Yeah. Which, we've said it in the past, man, radials are easy. I mean, we know. talked about it earlier in this video. I think this is the guy that I'm racing. Is this the guy that I'm racing? Yeah. He, he, he told me that he had a small block, but he left off the, all the other stuff. Uh, so anyways, and, and like I'm telling everybody else, man, they're going to figure it out. The Aussies aren't dumb. They're going to figure it out. This is the shit that we do. Yeah. We do this every weekend, so cut them some slack. Like, like uh, it, it, it'd be the same thing if we came over here and just had never bolted radials on the car before. Yeah. You know what I mean? So 
Uh, and so we're still getting people wondering why we didn't all bring our MPK cars. People, yeah. come on. You know, like if we would have all brought our MPK cars, they didn't have enough big tire cars to cover it first off. Right. And, and the ones that they do, you know, we're giving them the hit and stuff now With, on smalls. Without sounding like too much of an arrogant prick, man, their cars aren't what ours are right now. You yep. know what I mean? Well, they're they're I what think, our cars I, were I, I 10 years ago. Is, well, I think what it is is uh, they haven't got the technology down of the traction control. So basically, if we didn't have traction control, we'd go down four out of 10 passes. Well, the traction control helps us go down 90% of the passes. Yep. You know what I mean? It may not go faster, but it's gonna keep us from aborting a run. Yes. And I think that that's the biggest, uh, everybody says that uh, our technology is better. They have good parts here. They have good engines here. They have good uh, chassis here. I think that uh, a lot of them just uh, are like Chuck and they, and they race by the seat of their pants. Yep. You know what I mean? Which ain't nothing wrong with that. No. But we're just more consistent and they haven't been on this tire much. Yep. So other than that, they're gonna get the hang of it. Uh, I've said this before, before we got to be the fastest street racers, in, in my opinion, in the world, we got our asses whipped a lot. So you never get faster by not getting your ass whipped. I know, that thing's so cool. That thing's so cool. I think it's the same. Hey, so I'm gonna stop you here. What did car in the finals in the small tire race last night? I think so. Okay. Yeah, 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 yeah. They didn't. I didn't know that. Okay. Whenever we gave him the back yeah, yeah. tire. Just chicken. Yeah, no, it'll be, it'll be all right. Hey. Uh, win, lose, or draw, we came here for the fans. Oh, yeah. We're going to have a good time. And the man. fans are having an amazing I, I time. Gave, I gave him the back tire, but, you know, I cut a pretty good fucking light. Yeah. So, we'll see what happens. on a ferris wheel mate ferris wheel big one yeah gondola style big so, yeah man. big they're enclosed ac you think you can rock them like the one at the state fair i don't know i bet you can yeah i bet you can i see those ac units are on the top too like we got one of those that do my whole bedroom and you know they cool that little gondola oh yeah so this is called uh the wheel of brisbane Will of Brisbane. Will of Brisbane. So. Or Brisbane for you Americans. Man, they don't like that. They do not. But, you know, they, they call us Yankees. So True. what are you going to do? True. Um, there's definitely, even though we both speak English, there's a language barrier. <laughs> yes. Um, half the people at the track yesterday would be hollering stuff. And I, look, man, I, I have no idea what they're saying. Dude, that one guy. The one guy in particular that kept calling I you Shawnee? Yeah. The, guy, the drunk guy. Yeah. Uh, seemed really cool. Uh, I heard him call a guy a fucking wanker. Really? Yeah. <laughs> uh, well, he came up behind us when we were all doing the, the big photo. The group oh, photo. Oh, okay. He tried to come up behind us. And the security guards were telling him to move out of the way. You know? <laughs> they probably could have told him to move out of the way a little nicer. Oh, really? I think he got he got mad. Yeah. But, but you know, this is what it is. Yeah, yeah. So, yeah, no, we... And from everywhere in this city, we've seen this thing, and I really wish it was an open, you know, not a gondola style, yeah. so that we could, you know, look out the side, rock. Oh yeah, me too. Me you know, too. I bet you do. Yeah. 
It's my favorite. Uh, especially being scared of heights. Yeah, that's, what is that, 80, 90 feet up there? 100? <laughs> <laughs> it's more than that, dude. <laughs> I don't know, but they'll tell us. Tell us. But they'll tell us in meters, then yeah. we gotta do the and then we gotta convert and it, that. and I gotta get hey, on buddy, Google. How high up there is that? 60 meters. 60 meters? meters 180 feet. 180? 120. That doesn't math out, but okay. I think it, I think it does. I mean, a meter is three feet, three inches. Okay, 60 so. times three is 100, is 18, 880. But whatever. Whatever, it's ways. Yeah, it's ways up 60 there. 60 meters, guys. Yeah. 60 meters is a long way. Um, that's not gonna be that bad. Yeah, just rock it'll be fine. It'll be fine. So, uh, it was a man. It was a good weekend. Uh, we didn't really do a recap uh, of this weekend's races, but it, it was a good weekend. We fared well. Yeah. Um, no, the, the the cars hauling ass. The cars hauling ass. It's consistent as it can be. Uh, middle of the heat, we walked out. We got a little bit nervous. Um, we walk out. The sun is blazing. Uh, but for all the Oklahoma people, no, it is not hotter here. Yeah. Uh, I think I hear that more than I hear anything. How are you adjusting to the heat? <laughs> yeah. I'm not. You mean the cool? Yeah. Because it yeah, ain't there no hotter. wasn't really any adjustment. There's always a cool breeze. Like right now, it's like nice. she's fine with sleep. Like Aaron wears sleeves a lot. But yeah. Like even if I had a hoodie right now, it would be fine. Yes. Um, at night in Oklahoma City, it still feels like a hairdryer hitting you. Yes. 12 o'clock at night, you have the windows down and you're sweating. I mean, think about it, dude. In the summer, when we filmed the street show at 2, 3 o'clock in the morning, dude, still sweating. Hot. Yeah, hot. So, so anyways, but that's, that's the main question that we get is uh, how are you adjusting to the heat? There's no adjustments. Yeah, no, we're good. It's nice. Uh, the sun is... It's a little more aggressive. Strong, yeah. You know? Um, Makes its presence known. It does. It does. Uh, but anytime there's shade, it ain't bad at nope. all. Nope. So, anyways. So then I tell people, no, it's hotter in Oklahoma. Oh, but it's a dry heat. <laughs> We've talked about dry heat yeah. before. Uh, that's a myth. No. That's heat not true. Heat. heat is heat. Um, so, anyways. Uh, it was a good weekend. Uh, the, the Aussies are, are figuring it out. They're, they're they starting are. to, they're learning. They are learning uh, all the lingos. And I think their favorite American lingo is, I need the hit. Oh, is it? Oh, dude. I haven't got to be up there for the negotiations. <laughs> you should. <clears throat> you should come. Because that, that was standard. Yeah. That was standard <laughs> Give me the hit, mate. on Saturday's <laughs> uh, talks. Yeah. It was standard for ask for the hit. Like, yeah. uh, how can I not? Okay, I could just say, it doesn't matter who it was. You have a big tire Australian car with wheelie bars, big tire. <laughs> and you have a small tire American car. Yeah. The dude needed the hit. Yeah. Our American guy laughed and said, look, man, come on. <laughs> yeah. Just, and then even our big tire guy, I think his name was Jeff Lutz. Yeah. Said, how can you have a big tire and ask a small tire for anything? Yes. Anyways, it all worked out. Yeah. Uh, they're, they're figuring it out, and we're also figuring out what we are capable of giving them and what we're not capable of yeah. giving them. Uh, I feel like in Perth, we were firm on what we believe. <laughs> yeah. We believed this car sets like this car, it should be a heads They're the race. same. It's really not. They're not. Uh, but, but like I've talked to all of them, uh, I, I've been the, the giving person over here, you know what I mean? Yeah. Like, this isn't what they do. No. And we've talked about this already. We've talked about this isn't what they do. They're not, they're just learning. Uh, the guys are racers just like we are. So they're trying, you know? Sometimes it takes a little yeah. bit of time to get it going. And, and I've told a couple of them, look, man, radials are easy. Yeah. So. Well, here's the thing. Racing is what we do. You know what I'm saying? Like It's our job. We race for a living. That's how we make money. And we're not even that good at it. We're not, but we get to do it all the time, right? So let's put it this way. Uh, we can golf also. We're not good at it. We can't play Tiger Woods. That's right. Not even now that he's that's old right. and not that great. It's like some of them college teams. Well, that's that's bad because I've seen college teams that could be pro teams. Yeah. Okay, so it's like a high school team. 
playing a, a college team. Yeah. That's a big step. It is. You know? And not, not, not taking that, anything away not from that them. That high school team couldn't eventually be the college team. Yeah. That's kind of where we're at with them. You right. know what I mean? They're, they're just, they have no experience. But they're quick learners, man. Uh, the guy, that, the young kid that I raced. Oh, I'm sorry. Never mind. Damn. The little white car that I raced. Oh, cool okay. Kid, yeah. Cool kid. He's young. Yeah. You know what I mean? His whole team was young. Yeah. He looked like he had a, a twin brother, maybe. Yeah. I, uh, yeah, I know. I, I got confused. At one point, I seen the dude get out of the car, and I went, that's the guy I'm racing. And I was fixing to fire the car up. And yeah. I was like, that's the guy that I'm racing. It turns out that was his brother. Yeah. Um. Both of them look like uh, surfer bros. No, hang on, I got I got somebody in mind. Uh, who's the little kids from Tulsa that sing that song that I like from a long time? Oh, ago? Hanson. Mm-bop. They look like Hanson. <laughs> That's what they look like. They look like the Hanson brothers. Yeah. You know, didn't they? Didn't they? they look like sunshine <laughs> on uh, what's that movie? Uh, re- remember the Titans. Remember the Titans. Yeah. They look like sunshine. Yeah. So cool dudes, man. Hey, and afterwards, I, I spent five. 10 minutes down there bullshitting with them yeah. at the end of the track, you know, telling them, hey man, keep going. Well, keep going. Y'all y'all are going to get this. Yeah. Because that car was cool. Oh, yeah. That car was fast. It was. You know, it's just, they're not where we're at yet. Yeah. So, it, it's, it's, it's been a cool time and I know that the racers are all having fun. Uh, man, I'm telling you, the people in Brisbane showed up and they showed up. Dude, there were so it many of them. Oh, looks like we're about to go. Oh, look at us. We got we got no problem waiting. Yeah. This game had two dollars So on the way down to get you after every race, well the the last race specifically, man dude, there's so many people in the stands and when we went by they were cheering and right. hollering at us, dude. It was it was something else, man. So not like the dead silence. Yes. Yeah, no, it was dead silent. Yeah. Um, because even though all of them stand behind their racers, they were happy to see us over here. And yes. that's cool, man. Yep. You know? So, but I'm telling you right now, we start losing and they'll turn on you pretty quick. Oh, man, dude. They, they flipped the script on one of our drivers this weekend. <laughs> yeah. We've been doing well, though. The car's on rails. I couldn't be happier. Yeah. Uh, and for all the people who have been watching our, our YouTube, I know Frank's last name is not Dandy. Yeah, yeah. He's in my phone under Frank Dandy because he's well, Dandy so, Racing Engines. So get this. Whenever, like, a couple people wanted him to sign their stuff, he wasn't really cool with it. He goes, no, I don't I don't sign stuff. For no, Frank, you're a legend, mate. Yeah. So so he would sign it, Frank Dandy. That's what, that's what we've called him forever. Yeah. In fact, I'm pretty sure when I met him, that's how I was introduced to him. Yeah. This is Frank from Dandy Racing Engines. Yep. Frank Dandy. Frank Dandy. He's been in my, in my phone under Frank Dandy since 2016 on yeah. WhatsApp. Yeah. Thank you. Here we go. If, if we work together, we can really rock it. <laughs> I know. But I'll think not, about that. Nobody is working. We that's how, whenever we were little, my dad used to do. Like, yeah. Uh, that's the reason I like the tilt a whirl so much. Oh, yeah, because you can really get her swinging. Hey, if you know what you're doing and you got weight on your side. <laughs> yeah. So whenever I was little, I did that with Aiden, too, and he always acted like he liked it, but then he started feeling sick whenever he got off. Yeah. <laughs> what? Remember? <laughs> she won't ride with me. <laughs> Chicken shit. Yeah. So, um, but anyways, uh, Brisbane was amazing. It was, everybody said that it would be better than Perth. I'm not gonna say it was better than Perth, more people showed up than Perth. And, and, and everybody wanted to know too, that was real adamant about which track was better. Yeah. You know what I mean? I was like. The track surface here was better. The facility at Perth was nicer. And and that's not a jab at anyone. I feel like everyone knows. They, they even said there's more money at Perth in the drag strip. Yeah. So both tracks were very good though. Oh, they were. And I saw a lot of people going, "Yeah, but it's slippery out there, guys." No, <laughs> no, mate. Okay, we're gonna we're gonna look around. Oh, that's a cool picture back here. Look how far, fam. Look down. Jesus. <laughs> a long ways up you're, there. You're a rocket? No, Sean. <laughs> <laughs> that stems from way back. <laughs> There's a new hotel. Isn't that where we stayed at uh, Perth? Honey, look down. 
Oh, we're all the way at the tower. You're going down. No, we're not. No, we're not. Nope. Look Still down. Going Look up. down, Phil. Mm, mm, mm. How cool are these? They're cooler when they're not the gondolas, though. Oh, I feel a little safer when I'm encapsulated. Why? You can't jump out before you see something coming. <laughs> yeah, I think oh, hey, we're just sitting here now, rocking. Watch. <laughs> what? Oh, what? Oh, full moon tonight and everything. Well, you think people don't catch them all the time? Oh, yeah, no, we're just sitting up yeah, there at the top. The front moon must be stuck. Yeah. Probably never get down. Watch, it's going to rock as soon as it takes off, though, uh -huh. and it'll start swinging. That's the Brisbane River. Didn't they say it was pretty dirty one time? Is, is this not what we was on on the boat the other day? No, we were oh, we were way up south, north. Gold Coast, what? Yeah, oh, was it north? North. Yeah. Oh, I was fixing to ask you. Is that another wheel over there? Oh, I, I, I promise I was. <laughs> <laughs> hey, look, it's been a long time. A couple months. <laughs> a couple months. <laughs> So, hey, Look, turns out you can't call them abos. Oh, really? You like it? Did you try? Oh, oh no. Hang on. Hang on. Story time. No, no, it's not really a story. It's just I start. <laughs> you know the thing at the track where they give. What do they call it? They, they, that sheet of paper that they uh, that they say bef before they did our national anthem. Oh, okay. They give yeah, patronage. Like, yeah. Patronage? Is that what it's called? It's like a pledge or like It's a like a pledge. It's like a, yeah. they give thank you yeah. to the people before them. And it's the Aborigines. So I saw it and I was reading it while the girl on the mic was reading because we were standing up front. So I said, What's that mean? And afterwards, one of the racers came over to me and he explained to me what it mean. And I go, oh, the abos. And he goes, oh. And he looked at me like, like oh, no, is it a bad word? Do I, I need like, to beat these out? I was like, oh, you can't say that. I go, because somebody from here told me about the abos. Yeah. You know? And he goes, yeah, they don't call them that. And I was like, oh, okay. You know, I didn't know. Oh, man. Yeah, so I don't think that it, that, I mean. Is it frowned upon? I guess it's frowned upon. Yes, it's yeah, a That's oh, okay. what it is. Allegedly. I'm sure somebody's going to tell us, you know? Yeah. That they call them abos all the time. He said a different word, too. He did? He didn't call them abos? Indigenous. Indigenous. Yeah, yeah, that's what yeah. Yeah. people in America do. Yeah. Because yeah. I said it, that's, and he was like... That's just like native native land to people. Like, yeah. They were the first ones here, because at first, whenever I, I asked him about it, he goes, no, yeah, the people that were here before us, before the queen brought people over, and I go, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> so the person that we talked to that told us didn't say the politically correct term. Yeah. No. And we didn't know. Uh, yeah, it's the, that lady. The lady, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Now we know. And we're educated. We are not educated. We are more educated now. Like what about, what else have we learned? We learned a lot of terms. We learned Vegemite's gross. That's right. So as, the rest as, of the food. As, yeah, as they seen earlier in this video, when when uh, we tried Vegemite, I don't care what they say, it's not good. Somebody told me, no, no, mate, you spread it on the steak before you cook it. Oh. No, why would you ruin the steak? What was that noise? <laughs> <laughs> I hear this sound like an erector set falling apart. <laughs> oh, that screw? No, we don't need that screw. I think that's a good one. The bridge is cool, though. I think that bridge is the one that they built when the Olympics were here. When the what? Olympics were here. Oh. That wasn't I that long ago, was 2001? it? 2001. Oh, okay. Yeah, no, like I said, that wasn't that long ago. I think it's the one with the purple lights, but I'm not sure. Mm. So the 
shorten all the stuff here. It doesn't matter. You yeah. Just cut it in half and then add some letters. Yes. Oh, they're not saying anything. Huh. This one says operator to use only, but it gives you a button. <laughs> Oh, it is a compass. Where? Above your head. Oh. See, it's closed in. Yeah. You know. I'm sad. I can't look out. And, I know. Can't you know, over the side. Yeah, when we get way up here. But they know that people be, you know, putting stickers and stuff on these. Yeah. Tagging it. 